Speaking of settings, well, let's discover them. You scroll down to settings, but settings are also accessible via some buttons when you're inside uh, some screens. For example, here, you click on settings and you fall on the same settings page. So from top to bottom, uh, first, you need to make sure if you use some basic rules, make sure that you tick this radio button that you use basic rule or if you use advanced rules then you tick this one the difference between them is like if you create a rule from here or from there let's go back to settings now the tips are only merchant side admin side it's only for you you can hide them but we display some text some tips to help you better create your promotions this is uh, when a discount is automatically applied for example after some products are added to cart and meet some discount rules you can either show a discount uh, a pop-up or a notification bar or you can disable it um, it should look like i'm gonna show you an example I'll go. right now i enable the pop-up so now i meet the rule and the pop-up will be displayed this is the pop-up if i go back to settings inside this pop-up well this is inside the bar i could change the found color the background color the bar is similar to the pop-up i'm not sure it will uh, be displayed because it might ta take some time to propagate the changes but I will try to show you what it is yeah so it's still the pop-up but the bar appears at top you can change the colors you can change the colors of the um, of the pop-up as well here uh, you can show a close button top right corner or not you can edit the, the title of of the notification uh, in your own language or change the, this text in another English text you can edit the discount applied message you can show the amount that is saved uh, inside the pop-up or the bar or hide it you can well I think this is the most important important uh, feature of the settings alongside these and the choice of the pop-up is to decide if I go to checkout or go to cart when I click the call to action button so when I click When I click here, this link, and this is the bar, by the way, is it a link to the cart or to the checkout? Obviously, if you just switch to cart, you should edit the text there as well. And you can change the color, the call to action button, the continue shopping text, the color as well. You can hide the continue button or show. And this is for the pop-up only because in the bar, I mean, if you hide it, well, we, we could make the go to checkout bigger there um, and this is for the the the, the pre pre-filled carts the last two settings to edit the text that you see when uh, when when you preload the cart so if you don't use the pre-filled carts here you won't need to edit this setting well, I think that covers it all. Uh, these are the settings from the automatic discount app. If you have any question, click the FAQ or help button and submit the ticket.